Welcome to the Ombia Tutorials. In this tutorial we will run a presentation with some live group analysis. To get started, you need the Ombia Response software installed and running within Microsoft PowerPoint on your computer. We're going to start by creating a group assignment slide. To do so, click on the arrow just below the new slide button on the Ombia Response toolbar. We will use the analysis menu from the drop down options that appear. So go ahead and click on that. Within the analysis menu in this tutorial, we will use the first two options, group assignment and group results. Click on the group assignment first. You will see what looks like a normal Ombia polling slide. Use this question to invite people to categorize themselves into some kind of demographic group. In this example, we are asking people what team they belong to. Once you have typed in your options, click outside the box as you normally would do to update the chart. Now create a normal voting slide by clicking on the top half of the new slide button. In this example, we will ask our voters about their drinks preferences. Now go back to the analysis menu by clicking on the arrow below the new slide button and choose the group results option. In the dialog box that appears next, we see a list of questions we might want to analyse by group here. We want to see how drinks preferences vary across teams, so we make sure the drink preferences question is selected here. And down here we see the grouping slides we created. In our example, we select the team slide. When we click on insert, Ombia adds a new slide to our presentation which will display the drinks preferences by team. Let's start our presentation and see how this works. Click on start polling. This is our opening slide. Click onwards to get to our polling slide. Once the votes are in, we can see what kinds of people are in the room with us. This is all normal, but Ombia has paid particular attention to these votes so that we can analyse the results of other questions by these groups. Now we can see from this slide that tea is the most popular option, with water being the least popular. With normal polling, we would stop here. But if we click onto the next slide... After a moment, Ombia displays a bar chart that shows us how the different team members are spread across the varying drinks preferences. For example, you can see that the finance team in red is least likely to prefer water and most likely to prefer coffee. We can of course generate group analysis reports within our reporting tool after the session is over, but this kind of slide is very powerful for inspiring group discussion and debate. And that's it! You now know how to get even richer information from your groups. There are more tutorials and guides on our website that will show you how to make the most of Ombia, so feel free to check those out now.